welcome back to H&S. Hey guys, today we're going to be doing something really fun in between our um, Australia Day 1 and Day 2. The next one is going to be up soon, in case you were wondering, but today what we're going to be doing is a lush haul. Yay. There's a mall just across the street from wow. the place we're staying, and there's a lush store there, which is pretty cool, so we go a lot, and we got some stuff. You might not think it's that much, but if you've been to Lush before, you'll see that a lot, everything is really expensive. <laughs> yeah, like very. <laughs> yeah, super expensive. Off the so, considering those prices, we do have a lot of stuff. So, anyway, ready to eat. Okay. Bring well, in the tray. We even need a tray to hold everything. Yeah. Okay. So, here's our little, here's our first I don't, I don't. I don't know if you can see it. <laughs> so. We'll just explain what we've got, and then we'll demonstrate some of our stuff for you. So, just Not say what we got. Our, some of the things are just like ours individually, and some of the things we bought, jet or um, we bought together just as like together things that we would share. Okay. So, it's okay. We'll just show them first. Okay. Well, the total things that we got, Hannah will show half of it, and then I'll show half of it. So go ahead. Okay. Well, the first thing that we got is um this fun i don't know if you've seen fun. it before if you've been but it's called fun fun and this is fun. called the rainbow fun. Shh. Fun. basically the flavors are cherry lime and grapefruit oils are bursting from your palm fair trade vanilla sweetens and chamomile adds calms like some weird text on okay. well basically what it is is it's like play-doh like obviously you know what play-doh is um it's basically like the consistency of play-doh in it you can squish it and like mold it like play-doh except it's also soap like lush is really famous for making like different things that look different and feel different but they're basically all just different types of soap i'll go ahead from here we got something called rub 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 shower scrub <laughs> and it's kind of like it's just kind of like a sh as it said a shower scrub and when it comes to scrubs we've got it licked with Fragrant blossom scented sea salt scrub for your body and hair. Also, what we got is we got these. Sorry if you can hear a lot of beeping and sirens in the back. We're in the city right now. And it's, there's a lot of things. So basically, there's Whoosh, which is basically shower jelly. Whoosh. Called Whoosh. 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 Okay, so read the description. Uh, Whoosh was named after the sound of deadlines whizzing by. Useful for renewed focus and when tired, jet lagged, or revising for exams. Jet lag, that's good. We're really jet lagged right now. Mm -hmm. Well, basically, it's pretty self explanatory. It's a shower jelly, and it was just. It just. Smells good. Yeah. Okay, so next. Okay, next thing is. Cup O Coffee. It's a face mask, and it says, um, it's a face and body mask, and it says, let's have another cup of coffee. Uh, wake up your skin with this exfoliating mask. Leave it smooth and soft. Yeah, we've been My using the one, the face mask that I got is called um, Oat Fix, and it's basically there's a lot of different um, face masks and facial stuff at Lush. They all, but they all do kind of different things, like Sophie's like she said was to kind of exfoliate and smooth your skin and this one is to cleanse, soften, and moisturize dry sensitive skin. Okay. Yeah. Um, oh gosh. Uh, so um, then this is, it started with a kiss lip tint and um, yeah. Um, it says it's invented in this <laughs> <laughs> this one doesn't Imagine really just have like anything. going to the store and buying a thing and then like reading the description and it just says <laughs> Well, okay, basically, um Basically <laughs> it's soap there's a bunch of like cool looking things that kinda look like food or fruits or whatever and they can cut it and it's basically soap. And I'll actually show you what it looks like later. Right now. Later. Right now. Later. Later. Okay. Well then, I have this refresher, and it's another shower jelly, and it says refresh your body and mind with this zingy and refreshing treat for the shower. Okay, well then, the guy there helping us was really nice, and he gave us two free bath bombs because... Yeah, I don't even know why. 
Yeah, but um, we I don't have a bath where we're staying, so... Yeah, there's only showers, yeah, so, so we, we're gonna have to wait until we get home to use these, but... Basically, obviously, bath bombs are what they're most famous for, and I think it's really pretty. And basically, obviously, you know what they do, but you put them in baths and they... <coughs> you're not supposed to inhale them, though. Um, oh. it's kind of the same color as your onesie. Can you see it? What okay. we're gonna do is we're gonna the start... The whoosh. The, the whoosh and the refresher. No, it's... it's whoosh. <laughs> the whoosh. And the refresher. <laughs> the roll, the, this, the lid just rolled away like... This smells like lemon, and it smells like something. It smells like grapefruit. It's supposed to. <laughs> it, it really smells like a really citrusy detergent to me. And well, it looks like a jelly detergent. This is how you use mine. I don't know how you use hers. It says, take straight out of the fridge or freezer and into the bath or shower. The rush on... The rush of cold on your skin will send blood pumping to the surface, increasing circulation and stimulating in your can something beds. I don't know how to, I don't know how to say most of the words. It's the second last word. Capillary. Cap capillary. Okay, so um, I already used this little bit here. I'm just taking out a little bit to use. I've used mine before, like but this. I wanted to keep it solid. So. You can you can either take out the whole thing and use it. It's it's a soap by the way, so it's just like it's like gel. It's, it's not pointless. It's like Jello, but it's not taking that. It's like Jello, but it's like you can take the whole thing out like that and just use that. It's like a bar of soap, except it's jelly. Or you can take out a little piece like this if you want to save the rest for like if you want it to last long. You can start using it like soap. Just rub it together like this and as you can see it's starting to come kind of sudsy what I do is hand. for mine because I want to keep it solid I don't want to break it up um, I put I dip my fingers in it and I kind of rub it and then I just rub it over the part that I want to get soapy and then I put it back in the container because and then I just kind of get it more wet and then start going like this next thing we're probably gonna do is the fun it's rainbow cherry lime and grapefruit you already read this yeah I know Four in one multi purpose wash and play. Let me see. No, don't. Just take out one layer. Is it all connected or? I think not. <laughs> yeah. I think. Here, just take the one on the bottom. Okay, okay so okay. that's what it looks like. Oh, you can I still want it. It's okay. Ah! Whoa! <laughs> oh, God. You can obviously detach them, the layers, if you mm -hmm. so that it will last a long time. I didn't just scream like that. That was just also poor like I, like I was saying before, um, the price range that these are the least expensive one we got was around seven dollars. This product and was made by the Claire. Most, the most expensive was probably around um, four, sixteen. Yeah. Sixteen dollars or so, and those are those are that's like the cheap range for Lush like uh, thing. Things can get up to like $170 depending on. It depends though. Really? Like you can get smaller sizes. So just I wash your bigger pieces. No, but you have to wash your hands. Um, I'm just what I've made so, something. Let me as you can. <laughs> I made something like this before, and it's kind of like Play-Doh, kind of. As you can see, let me talk. <laughs> yeah, you don't need to use a lot. I realize that the color is coming off of it as well. Like it's kind of making my it smells hand kind good of pink, too. but I'm sure it won't stay after you wash it off. It smells good. Too. Our hands are going to be very frequency after this video. Yeah. Also, we have face masks. Also, you can use this on any part of your body that you want. It's not. We're just doing hands in the video because. I guess you could do hair, but I don't. Yeah. What if I said hair? I wouldn't. For the I, Yeah, for body and hair. So. Pinch off the small piece. I feel like. Um. You should rip off. <laughs> I feel like I feel, sorry. <laughs> um, I feel like um, you once you take a piece and start using it, it, it feels weird. And it, if you merged it back with the other part, it would feel weird. This one, I saw it in the store, and it, it feels really nice to squeeze and stuff. And this this basically just helps you. Um, it looks kind of like I don't know, like some a scrub because it obviously is. It, it's a bit liquidy though. It, I guess the one in the store sat out a bit without the lid on, and that's why it kind of hardened. You could but put it in the fridge. Basically, are you supposed to? I think you're supposed to get your hand a little bit wet. Our hands are already wet. Like you're supposed to wash it off afterwards. It won't obviously soak into your skin. 
We also, we didn't, I don't think we got any kind of lotion because our skin is like really sensitive, so. Yeah, we didn't get any lotion, lotion just because we wanted to, like, you can basically get a lotion like anywhere. We wanted to try all the exotic things like the scrubs and the bath bombs and the exotic jellies and the whoosh, which, which is the jelly, but okay. So it's kind of, it. It doesn't, it's it's kind of rough and it, it definitely feels... It kind of like feels like it's taking off some of the dry skin, I guess. Like that's what it, the scrubs are for. Yeah. Like taking off dry skin. It also smells good. Like, Ooh, it, after you wash it, smells it off, kinda, it, it smells really, really fresh. Good. Like it also kind of smells like your grandma's house. Like I don't know how your house, your grandma's house smells specifically, but just a generic grandma's house smells like that and pretty good. What I'm intaking from this experience. Your hands, I, I don't know if it's just me because we've used a bunch of the products already, but my hands came out really smooth afterwards. This is our first time using it. Okay, so uh, um, also it says top tip all that salt makes is perfect for washing hair and adding volume, so you can use this on your hair. Yeah, Most you of these products you can use on your hair. Yeah, I think it's, it's obviously a lot of them are also for sensitive skin too, which is really good, I think. And after that, that, I would really recommend that scrub. It, my hands are so smooth right now. These, the fun you can use on your hair, and this one you can use on your hair. Yeah, not the whoosh though. <laughs> actually, yeah, I actually mm -hmm. did read on the whoosh that sure. you could wear. That you could. Why use do you it. call it the whoosh? Because it's called the whoosh. Chill it, freeze it, or use it straight from the pot. Stroke our wobby bit over your wobby bits in the shower. <laughs> it's okay. They're they're British. They can be excused from that kind of language. It's so like soft too. Cup o coffee. Cup o coffee. Oh! <laughs> Not oh, that big a deal. Don't do that. Well, we'll spill the water and it will go whoosh. It'll go whoosh. Is this the rub rub rubby duck duck? Well, basically, this is Sophie's cup o coffee and my oat fix. Um, so. These are, obviously you can see hers is bigger. Hers was slightly more expensive than mine, but they do different things. Oh, we didn't- Hers is- it. It's fine. We'll do it after. We'll do it after. Um, yeah. This one wakes up your skin and ex is exfoliating and leaves it smooth and soft, which it really does actually. She's mm -hmm. tried it a couple times and it makes and her faces Well, smooth. what the woman said when she sold it to us, she was really nice. Um, she said that um, it brightens your skin, and that one makes you smell like a cupcake. And she's like, "Well, when we bought it, because we were talking to her a long time and like telling her her background and stuff." And it. she's like, "We'll just oh, tell you. We'll just show you like what the inside looks like. The, like there, it basically looks like oatmeal. Mine smells like coffee, which is really amazing. Mine's not very visible when no. you put it on. Like it's more chunky when you scoop it out." But Sophie's is very visible and it kind of looks like a seaweed mask. Like, um, well, mine has to sit for 10 to 15 minutes. Hers has to sit to 5 to 10. So she's going to wait 10 and I'm going to wait 10. But we're not going to make you wait 10 minutes with us because we're that awesome. Okay. Here's the little soap thing that I was talking about um, that I had at the beginning. It looks like this. But yeah, it's very nice. It smells like lean. It's basically soap. I, I think you just use the whole thing as a bar of soap, but I feel like I would want to break it because I don't want to use all of it at once and like ruin it, but I think you are supposed to use it all at once, so I'll probably do that when it's time. We're not going to demonstrate this one because it's we're too gonna... hurry. Yeah, I know. I want to use it for real use. Yeah. So. Well, oh, my, there, there's my tail. Okay, so well, what we're gonna do now is the lip tint. It's not gonna take a long time. I'm gonna go really close to the camera. Oh god. It's so basically, what it does is this it is might look really it. disturbing. So I'm going over here. Hey, welcome it's H to H official. Uh, what we're gonna be doing after Sophie uses the lip tint is we're gonna be doing our facials. So excuse me. Well, um. Yeah, so we're gonna put those on, and I'll try to. What I'm gonna try to do during editing it. Pretty. What I'm gonna try. Pretty. I'm pretty, aren't I? Not really. I'm gonna. So basically, as you can see, so we put on the thing. Um, what it's supposed to do is fix cracks in your lips, which I don't really have, but I have basically 
dry lips. No. <laughs> I, I have dry lips and um uh it it's supposed to give you some color in your lips. So I'm gonna go get my thing from the fridge, so I'll be right back. Hey, we've and gone over to face cam. We have our little face masks. Um, mine's out fake, so like we said, cup of coffee. So yeah, we will start playing these. So mine says to keep it refrigerated. So if he doesn't, it's just it says you can freeze it or anything. Actually, you're not supposed to freeze it. <laughs> just supposed to put it in the fridge. But I just put it in the freezer for a couple seconds while we were filming. So because I thought it, if it became thicker, it'd be easier to apply anyway. So yeah, um, just a warning, mine looks a little bit like someone threw up on my face when I put it on, so just gonna... Graphic. Not really. Proceed with caution. And you have to, it says how long on each container, how long you leave it on. Mine is about, is 5 to 10 minutes and Sophie's is longer, it's 10 to 15. So... Just put it on and avoid your eyes and nose. You can put it- I mean your nostrils, you can put it on your nose, but like, below. Awesome. As you can see. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like... Also, if someone asks us in the comments what everything is, or like, what cream is that? I'm gonna be like, watch the video, hun. Because we've said multiple times what everything is. Uh, it's okay. I mean, don't, <laughs> don't mean to sound pushy, but seriously. This drops a lot. <clears throat> okay. Sophie, your hair is in my way of my face. <laughs> that's gonna be the thumbnail. I know. I hope that's not the thumbnail. Mm. No one will watch the video at all. Uh, so basically, with Sophie's, you just try and rub it in and the places that basically everywhere to get exfoliated with mine you um it's to kind of help dry skin so kind of put it in the places that you have dry skin on your face so also it's not a peel off mask so um yeah, you need to wash it off you wash it water. off so it's i think it's okay if you get it in your hair because you can wash it off but don't deliberately put it in your hair because that's just being don't be an idiot, kids. <laughs> you can't really see mine. Nope. Just little chunks. Like if you saw her on the street, you'd think that she was on a roller coaster, she threw up, and then it went. Actually, if I saw this on the street, I'd probably just think I had like a really bad skin condition that like made it lumpy or something. Okay. I'm not done. You took all the spotlight. So there. That, does that doesn't happen. do anything. Okay. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. The spot. Aren't I a beauty? <laughs> okay. Okay. So, right, so we're gonna minutes. wait 10 wait. minutes. Hey guys, so now we've waited um, 10 minutes. So, yeah. We waited 10 minutes for our masks to soak in and us to become nice. Things that smell wonderful. So we have a bowl of hot water, or warm, warm water here, and basically you're supposed to wash the mask off with warm water after the time is over. So we've got our cloth here. We're gonna start wiping off the mask. Oh no, they're stuck. We're stuck like this forever. <laughs> and I would suggest if you're gonna do the mask, only do it one time a day. This is our second time doing the mask, and it was kind of painful. Yeah, we we did it this morning to yeah. try it out, and then we're doing it right now for the video. I would, but it's, no. it started to burn after a while, so, so we only. I probably recommend doing it only once, once a day, so maybe even once a week. No, because I did it yesterday. So. Oh, never mind. Um, I would say once a day max. Like, I did it yesterday, and it made my skin really smooth. So I would say once a day, not twice. Definitely. Different it might burn your skin, like it depends what kind of skin tone you have. Skin tone is the color of your skin. Not skin tone, skin tone. 
It matters your skin tone on skin whether it burns or not. Skin. So if you're very tan, it won't burn, so don't worry. <laughs> So yeah, mine was kind of hard to see anyway in the first place, so you won't even notice it's gone. It makes your face really smooth and it just takes away redness and dryness. Hey guys, so we finished washing yep. our faces and it feels so smooth. smooth. I feel reborn. Yes. Like a new person. A new H and a new S. Yes. So, new H and S official. Hope you enjoyed Good. that. Um, little lush haul for you. Um, yep. It was just kind of an in-between video um, as we finish editing our Australia vlogs. So that will be up soon and be sure to, to like, comment, and subscribe. subscribe.